I am out here in the hottest part of the day checking on these broody hens. They will not relent on being broody, just like me. All eight months pregnant, they want to be mamas too. However, it is very dangerous for them to be sitting inside these nesting boxes in extreme heat. So today, it's, right now it's 103 been 104 105 yesterday I don't want them to be hatching any more eggs it's very dangerous right now in the heat and they're giving me a hard time so I have to pull her out every day um, put her in the dog crate but I feel so bad because it's so hot that the dog crate gets um, in a sunny spot so I need to move it I keep her in there for about three days until fully I keep taking her out because I feel bad but I need to keep her in there three days for her to stop her broody cycle barn offers a really nice shade in the middle of the day hottest part of the day you can find oh city you can find my chickens right here cold sponge and I have two water spots for them. In the morning, it's the kitty pool. I fill this up with fresh water and I try to put a perching station so they might be able to like stand above the water, but I have yet to see them do that. As the sun comes this way, all of this gets super hot. So then they start migrating over here. And then I fill up the second pool with water. It's also just to help the dogs as well cool down and the sheep. This creates a nice cool spot. Shade and water, cool fruit snacks. So I'm not going to put them in the same crate anymore. I'm going to have to figure out another situation for her, who's been extra broody and eating all the eggs. She eats the eggs and then sits on them, the broken eggs. So I don't know. Chickens are kind of funny that way. The other thing that you can do is dump them in water and cool off their body. Mm-hmm. Seti, oh, Seti, 
Set. Out. Out. I'm happy to report that this broody hen is out walking around and not being broody. So it's her turn now to be in here. Two broody hens trying to break their cycle. Um, I don't have two dog crates, so one is just gonna have to stay in there. And I put the other one in cold irrigation water to help break her cycle. And the third one, it worked. She's all the way out there. She was in here for three days. And uh, it worked because she's not in the nesting box today. So We're really blessed we'll to have irrigation goes. water, which Eight. helps the pasture, but also cools the chickens down and the dogs. So it's really great.